Dr. Jason Saunders here with HBOT USA. Our next question is, if hyperbaric is so wonderful, why aren't more people using it? Honestly, that's really why I'm doing these videos because, you know, I think that there's a lot of misconceptions, there's a lot of myths, and there's a general misunderstanding with how hyperbaric works, why it works, and why people would want to use it. And so questions like, how many sessions should I do? Is this therapy safe? Is it safe for my children? Is it safe for my spouse or my parents? You know, people don't fully understand the mechanisms and therefore um, don't understand the value. So um, why aren't more people using it? That's why. I mean, if, if people generally knew that this was a very safe therapy, which it is, they knew the mechanism for how and why it works, which we covered in some other questions. They had access to it because they either could find a local clinic or find someone that could help them get a home unit where they can treat at home. And they knew the full value of what hyperbaric oxygen had to offer. A hundred percent, you would see more people using it. And I think we're finally at that place. Hyperbaric oxygen is literally about 350 years old. That's how long people have been use, using varying amounts and types of pressurized environments. And finally, in the last 10 years, but really in the last two or three years, more and more people are learning about hyperbaric oxygen, what it does, how it works. And now more and more patients are looking for clinics offering hyperbaric oxygen for these international in indications um, outside of the traditional uh, insurance-based indications that exist. So uh, absolutely over the next few years, we're going to start to see an enormous increase in availability of hyperbaric oxygen because more and more private doctors are offering it. And we're going to be seeing a massive increase in patient utilization, patients looking for hyperbaric oxygen to help them with whatever issues they might be having.